friends, Romans, kaiju fans, join I, Brandosaurus Rex, as I unbox a figure for you. <laughs> I'm an idiot. So hey, what's up guys? I'm going to be unboxing the Sci-Fi Rebel Tech Series number 12 Mothra figure. God, why are these figures so named so long? I just don't get it. But yeah, so I got my hands on the Sci-Fi Rebel Tech Mothra because I just finished buying the new SH Moss Arts Godzilla 64 figure. So I decided to get Martha to go with it because what is Godzilla without his opponents? So let's get a crack at this open. Oh, spew of good photos going on here. Love the way this looks. Can't read Japanese, so that's gonna fall on deaf ears. So cool photos from the movie. I love the way this looks. You have actually of the black and white version and also the Technicolor version, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'm an idiot. I'm just making it up as I go along. <laughs> I forgot the year this movie came out, too. I filmed this twice. <laughs> this intro twice, and I said the wrong year the first time. So, God knows what I'm talking about. So, here we go. Here's the figure. Looks really cool, actually. I love how beautiful this looks. It really does look like the SH Monster Arts one, just smaller with different details, which I like. And also buildings, which, God, if the SA Smash came with buildings, I would just love them even more. But cool enough, this is cool on its own. Let's flip it to the back. Got more photos of Martha and all the cool things that you can do with the figure. And also on the side, whoa, dropped it. Also on the side here, we have a cool photo of Martha. And on the other side, we got some Rebel Tech Mumbo Jumbo. And on the bottom, how to work it, and also a license. From 2010 so this figure is quite old so without further ado let's pop this thing open This figure is tiny as hell, which I expected because I own a lot of the Rebel Tech figures so far, and all of them seem to be very small. But, but I do have some opinions about it because I did take a few minutes to mess around with it and kind of just get it all to my liking, you know, and you know, testing out the articulation and stuff like that. So, for all of that good stuff, I'm just gonna save it all for a review because. There's way too much I want to talk about with this figure to just cover it in a simple unboxing. So stay tuned for the unboxing. Whoa, stay tuned for the review of this guy. Um, or excuse me, of this girl or this lady, excuse me. <laughs> I'm just having all kinds of bolts today. So just stay tuned for the review where I would just basically explain everything that I like and don't like about this figure. And I hope you guys stay tuned for that. So I'll check you guys out next time. Peace! That's crispy.